Hey, it's Ethan here at eTrailer. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Yakima Fresh Track Ski and Snowboard Carrier on our 2022 Toyota RAV4. This is the four ski, two board version, but there's also a six ski, four board version available as well, and it doubles as a fishing rod holder in the warmer weather months. So if you're looking to get longer pairs of skis or snowboards where you need them to go, you don't want to keep the wet skis and snowboards in the car or you just don't have room for them, a ski and snowboard carrier like this one from Yakima might be a good option for you. It's just going to hold your boards or skis in place with these rubberized moldings through these jaws of the actual carrier. On the front here you can see there are very large buttons that you can push even if you have larger gloves or mittens on in the winter and you can still get it open. Again, you can take a closer look at this rubberized molding that I talked about. It's on the top and the bottom. Not only is it going to protect your gear from damage, but it's also going to keep it from sliding around too bad. If I close it down, you can see that there are a couple of different stops. So there's one, two, and three. No matter which one it's at, it's going to be able to still stay closed and is not going to pop up. But you do have a couple different options varying on how thick the skis or snowboards are that you're carrying. And you can see there is a lock core on the front, so it'll lock the carrier and no one will be able to get your skis or snowboards out. So I'll hit this big button again, we'll get our skis unloaded, and we'll talk a little bit more about the clamps and how they hold on to our bars. So we're working with aero style crossbars, so they're pretty streamlined. As you can see, they're still holding on pretty tightly, but you can see the clamps have this gap in the middle for your square or your round crossbars as well. So they'll work, they will work with them as well. These are just hand tightened knobs. So the installation of the clamps is tool free, which is nice. And you can see on the front here, there is this bolt that is a security Allen wrench only to turn that. So that'll secure the carrier to the crossbars. As you can see, the carrier isn't the most low profile thing in the world. So if you want to know how much space you're going to be adding onto the top of the crossbars, for us from the top of the crossbar to the top of the carrier, it's about five inches and they do stick pretty much straight up. So you're going to hear a little bit of wind noise on the top of your vehicle as well. As far as from the crossbar to where your skis are going to sit, it's about three and a half inches. So that's how much room you're going to have for the bindings before they make contact with the roof. That being said, the Fresh Track does have a ski lift riser system in the back. So it'll lift up and give you plenty of room for your bindings. Additionally, as you can see, we have ours on a little bit of overhang here to make it easier to get them on and off, the skis and snowboards that is. And we still have more than half of our crossbars to work with. So they don't take up a ton of space along the crossbars and we would have room for some other accessories on there if we wanted to. Overall, the Yakima Fresh Track is still a really solid value option if you're looking to get the amount of skis and snowboards that we talked about where you need it to go. That being said, they aren't the most low profile thing in the world. And if you're gonna look at these, I would recommend also taking a look at the Yakima Fat Cat Evo. They also have the ski rise system in the back, but they're more low profile and they do have a black finish. So they match the aesthetic of the RAV4 just a little bit better. But again, the fresh tracks are still a really solid option and a good fit overall for the 2022 Toyota RAV4.